back at this Ross, definitely found some good things here, jerseys and shoes. Let's go ahead and look around and see what we can come across today, you dig? Puma basketball shoes, pretty good to hoop in, just no resale with them. Bigger size on these unisex Converse. We have some more of the same. Well, I'm not sure about these flows, these curries. They want 45 for them. Let's check them out here. I'm sure you guys can see $45 compared to 113 online. This is what they're asking around $179.69. See if anything sold. 36 of them listed, so it's kind of flooded, pretty flooded. Most recent sale, May 20th for 56 bucks. Not much margin there. This is something we're going to leave behind as well. They do also have these uh, Witness 7s, 17. They do have these um, Infinity Flyknit runs we've seen before with not enough profit. Kyrie Infinities, 59 bucks for a size 17. If we get these down to like 29 bucks or 19.99, I'll pick up the size. I do have bigger sizes on my website, BoscoesGoodies.com, but I need somebody to buy something before I buy more. You dig? Under Armour shoes, the Kyrie Flytrap 6, as well as the Kyrie Infinity, once again, for uh, 59 bucks, size 18 on those, man. Interesting on the colorway. One listed for 49, one listed for 120, 100. Let's see if there's anything. Only four results listed, too, so it's definitely not a flooded item. Two results, March 21st, March 18th, 69. So inconsistent. Only two have sold recently, but way back in March. So we might have to sit on these for a minute, even though we are in basketball season. They're on sale for 30 bucks. This might not be a bad thing. What would you guys do? If we check out this hat section, I'm gonna swim through this real quick and see if there's anything in here to find because there are some bangers in the hat section for what I've been seeing other people find. Now, definitely all the sections is something, it's kind of back to the old ways almost. You gotta kinda, you kinda gotta check all your sections that you normally do to find the deals. And there are deals everywhere for the most part, you know, depending on what you're looking for. Bulls hat, not too bad. Trucker hat. Nothing that I'm looking for right now, so I'm gonna leave this one. Here in the men's section, I did search through this. I did not find anything that I could rock with. So let's go ahead and move on over to the next section, which is women's shoes. We're seeing these all around all the time. 49 bucks, not enough profit. If we can get these down a little, like 10 more dollars, might take a chance on them. And they've been sitting most places I see them, so they will start to go down a little cheaper, hopefully. These chucks right here got some nice, really, really nice leather quality on the upper. 39 bucks compared to 80. Makes me curious just to see what these could be going for, being that they're such plush sneakers. Let me go ahead and look this up and see what's up. Six form, this is what people have been asking. 18 listed only. Let's see what they're talking about with the sales and comps. Let's see. Six sold, 49, 52, 39, 96. Most recent, May 28th. Recency, but uh, not too much of a profit, so we're gonna leave them alone. More of these Adidas Candace Parker shoes. They look pretty good. I hear they're good for basketball, but the resale's not there. It's here, 19 bucks size, five and a half, 19 for 65. Let's see what they're going for as far as recent. So this might be a grab for me. 21 so May 29th, most recent for 65 bucks. Kind of like these margins a little bit more. Looks like it's dirty though. I can't tell. Is this the colorway? I think it's a little dirty because the pictures that I'm showing. Yeah, these are filthy. Look at the color. Totally different. Got to leave these alone too then. These little bags in the women's section are pretty cool for this time of year. $14.99. $30 the retail tag. Look at the ranking. Not a crazy margin there, and Amazon is on the listing for 27 bucks. There are 13 listed for FBA, and they go as high as what 45 bucks, but 34 for FBA makes me makes me wonder. The ranking is actually pretty good. What would you guys do? Black and white, white and black. That's a, that's a colorway a lot of people would like. It's actually 13.99 for 30 bucks. Ranking on this one is pretty good too. $27 also for Amazon's on that. But look at the ranking, look at the reviews. These little backpacks do have some potential and they go pretty quickly. 
maybe this is something that you I wouldn't have to sit on to get the highest price, but it's just that they are flooded. You feel me? $9.99 for this Adidas uh, backpack that's going for $60. They have it here with a pretty high ranking. $55.99 for FBA. Do these women's active shorts because there are definitely some shorts around that I haven't found myself, but they have some definite some resale value to them. Shorts, but not the ones I'm looking for. $14.99 for $30. Bucks. There's some that sell for over $100, which is crazy. But this is not it, so we're going to leave it alone. These are only going for... 25 there is a good ranking though 14.99 for 25 22 listings also what i'm looking at 16.99 you got 52 bucks these are like these are not track these must be like tennis shorts like playing tennis the sport do they have any more here adidas no that's new balance no let's go ahead and scan these really quick do not come up when I scan them. These around all the time for 49. Now I see these around all the time for 49 bucks and I pass them up because I've seen other colorways that didn't have any resale value. 44.99 and then they have them here for the same amount. So there's actually no resale value in this colorway either. I just had to do this for myself to make sure I wasn't just passing up on something, assuming they have sold very recently, but the price point is just not there. Now look at this. I think I've seen two pair of these. They do have the extra laces. No spikes. Oh, these don't have knee spikes. These don't knee spikes. Before when I saw these, I thought these were something that required spikes, but they don't. And they do have a resale value. You see they're going for 34 bucks comparable to 112. Most recent sales on Amazon. This is what they're listed for. Let's go see what they sold. I think I found two of these here. No matches. So nothing sold, only listed. That's a little call for Paul, slightly. Damn, none sold, but we are in like track season. And we are in track season, right? So I'm gonna take out the filter. So we do have some listed, 18 of them are listed, 109, 109. Potential, potential right here. This first two made me think like, yeah, let me grab them. What would you guys do in this situation? I think I'm gonna grab these though. So I have this black colorway for 35 bucks. Not looking the same. These are listed as pre-owned though, so I don't see anything for new. No one sold. So the black one's not even really there unless it's a used pair. So I think these might be our two finds right here. The two best finds of the day have to be these cleats. If I say so myself, right? Two cleats. The orange ones have more promise, but I think both of them do because there's no black ones listed. New. So uh, we're probably going to scoop these and put these on Goat and Macari. That's what I'm thinking. This Marshall's right next door, and look what they have here. Two 70s. They want $70 for them, though. Definitely dope to find these here, size 8. Then they have another one here, eight and a half, with the retail tag, as you guys can see, 69 bucks, 69.99. I mean, it's definitely a good price for personal. Not sure for resale though. Anything else here? Converse, the Chuck Taylors, nothing else really here. Two. $49 for the Nike boots, size 12. That's actually a pretty good size for those. Got some red new balances here. Then we got some more Nikes for 49 bucks. The Super Reps, 49 bucks. That's a good price. Good to see them here. As you guys can see, the selection is kind of iffy. There are some things here that we might grab, but let me know what you guys think about these finds. A lot of things that you see in this video and other videos will be available on my website, BoscoSkitties.com. Shout out to the people who have been shopping there. I really do appreciate that. That's the best way to support me. I got a lot of good stuff on there too, you dig?